Whiskey Jack. So this is a tribute to Stomp and Ton. Duncan is an old pal of Stomp and Ton. He's written a really interesting book about traveling with Stomp and Tom. And if you stay for the performance and hang in, you will be eligible for that fabulous raffle. Duncan, come on out here. Thank you, Thank you sir. Yeah. Great to see you here. Good to see you. It's nice of you to do that. Thank you. Okay, Whiskey Jack, key of A. A one, two, three, four. I think, uh, I think you're a visionary, Moses. Stop at Tom Connors and the Royal Conservatory of Music. It works for me. I don't know where Tom is right now, but I'm sure he's got a big smile on his face. So as Canadians, we define ourselves by many things. We're kind people, we're welcoming, we make a lot of maple syrup. We play a rough and tumble brand of hockey. And don't forget, Duncan, we're the people that gave Margaret Atwood to the rest oh, of the yes, world. Oh, uh, yes, one of our biggest exports these days is Margaret Atwood. But internationally, we're also famous for our music. There are many legendary musicians from the last century who made it possible for the musicians on the stage here to live a life in music. And tonight, we're going to salute them. And the one that had the most effect on Whiskey Jack was Stomp and Tom Connors. It was back in 1990. I first started recording and touring with Tom, and I soon learned that every show began with these four words. It's but the spud from the bright red mud rolling down the highway smiling. The spuds are big on the back of Bud's rig and they're from Prince Edward Island. They're from Prince Edward Island. Now from Charlottetown or Summerside, they load him up for the big long ride. He hops in the cab and he's off with the prime of Vegas. He's got to catch the boat to make Tormentine as he heads up the old New Brunswick line. Through the Montreal, he's just a flying with another big load of potatoes. Now, the thing is, the Ontario Provincial Police, they don't think a whole lot of Bud. Now, the cops have been looking for the son of a gun as he's dreaming with Phil on the 401. The name of the truck shines up in the sun. Green Gables. He makes Toronto about seven o'clock as he backs her up to the terminal dock. All the fellas gather around just to hear him talk about another big load of potatoes. It's Bud the Spud from the bright red mud, rolling down the highway smiling. Now before Tom, when I was a young lad up in northern Ontario, I'd sit in front of a little black and white television, not unlike the one you'd see in, in Moses Museum down at Sumerplex. And me, along with millions of Canadians, we'd sit there and we'd eagerly await the most unlikely superstar. He was a quiet, humble man in a show on the CBC. His name was Don Messer. And Don, we'd watch and we'd see the people that would become part of our lives, the Ann Murrays, the Stomp and Tom Connors, the Gordon Lightfoots. And Don Messer started his show like this. We're going to the barn dance tonight. Got my dancing boots on, got my Sunday best. Going to the barn dance tonight. Got date with my gal, the one I love the best. Going to the bar dance tonight. Talking but you strutting, just watch me put it on. I don't begin to get my wind till the break of dawn. And I'll still be dancing when all my friends are gone. Going to the bar dance tonight. Take it away, Randy. Five-time Canadian national fiddle champion, Randy Morris.
Now, before TV, Canada had its own superstar, a man who was as famous in the 1940s as Drake is today. When our parents would sit down on a Saturday night and listen to the CBC radio, the international star of the day was a humble man from Port Milford, Nova Scotia, and his name was Wilf Carter. And to help us with this song, I want to welcome to the stage eight-time judo-nominated female vocalist of the year, international recording artist, country music hall of fame, Marie Buttrell. Thank you. Oh, how my lonely heart is aching tonight for the town I long to see. Oh, what I give just to be there tonight with that sweetheart waiting for me in the blue Canadian Rockies spring is sighing through the trees and the golden poppies are blooming round the banks of Lake So blue for the blue Canadian Rockies and the gal I love so true. Help me out, Randy. So yeah, Douglas John Cameron singing that song. Two times Juno award, uh, went, uh, nominated. Stomp and Tom, Will Card, Don Messer laid the groundwork for us, for our generation to have a, a life in music. And today, one of the greatest of today's uh, of today's singers, six-time Juno Award winner with his band Prairie Oyster, numerous gold records, platinum records, Country Music Hall of Fame. The great Russell DeCarl. Well, my heart aches are all gone. I feel there's something coming on. I feel like singing away my blues. Got my fingers in a snap and got my toes in a tap. I feel like singing away my blues. Not a worry, not a care, no regrets and no despair. I'm recuperating fast from a dark and dismal past. Oh, my heart aches are all gone. I feel a song coming on. I feel like singing away my blues. Yeah, Randy. Duck hey, my window blinds a tear Took a big breath of good fresh air I feel like singing away my blues 
Give my face some water splash Through my troubles in the trash I feel like dawn in my dancing shoes Not a worry, not a care No regrets and no despair I'm recuperating fast From a dark and dismal past Oh, my heartaches are all gone I feel the song coming on I feel like singing away my blues Got my fingers in a snap, got my toes in a tap. I feel like dawn in my dancing shoes. Not a worry, not a care, no regrets and no despair. I'm recuperating fast from a dark and dismal past. Oh, my heartaches are all gone. I feel the song coming on. I feel like singing away my blues. You like singing away my blues Oh, delay, oh, delay Thank you Here's one from our new CD It's about Toronto Everybody, here we go I've been a streetcar driver About a dozen years I know that old Toronto city well There's a whole Waiting on the tracks for the signal from my clanging trolley bell. So kindly have your ticket ready when I open up the door. Please move on back down the aisle. I will drive you back to work and I will get you home again. I will try to render service with a smile. Cause I'm a TTC skedaddler. I got a socket to my big red rattler. I got a socket to my big red rattler. Here we go. Cause I'm a TTC skedaddler. I got a socket to my big red rattler. I got a socket to my big red rattler. Socket to my big red rattler. I got a socket to my big red rattler. Rockview Station, change here for cars going east or west. Please, we'd like to bring back to the stage to sing what undoubtedly is perhaps one of the most popular Canadian songs ever written, certainly one of the most genius songs ever written. And we're so grateful that Marie Bottrell is here to sing it. We don't even need to introduce it. Ever 
Would you stay and help us with this next one? You know, I think the conference began with the national anthem, so, but we all know that the real an an national anthem is this song. Hello out there, we're on the air. It's hockey night tonight. The tension grows and the whistle blows and the puck goes down the ice. The goalie jumps and the players bump and the fans all go insane. Someone roars, Drake scores at the good old hockey game. Oh, the good old hockey game is the best game you can name. And the best game you can name is the good old hockey game. Now here's the thing, folks. We've, we take this uh, song, we've been playing this song across the country for five, six years now. And uh, everywhere we go, everyone says, oh, we can sing it louder than that guy. But I tell you, um, I think the, uh, the curling club in Wawa could sing it louder than what we just heard there. So we're going to have to do a lot better than that. I should also tell you that when we, did the, uh, the, when we did the Walk of Fame, Tom was inducted into the Walk of Fame. Uh, the famous Irish baritone, Brian Mulrudy, was in the audience. And I'm sure you may not be able to sing as loud as him, but we're, we're kind of hoping, OK? Oh, skates a flash, the players dash, the home team trails behind. And they grab the puck and go bursting up, and they're down across the line. They swarm the creeks like bumblebees, travel in a burning flame. Someone slides the puck inside, it's a 1-1 one -one hockey game. A good old okay, we got one period left, and this is your chance. Oh, take me where the hockey players face off down the rink, and the Stanley Cup is all filled up with a chance to win the drink. One final flick of a hockey stick and one gigantic scream. The puck is in, the Leafs win the good old hockey game. Oh, the good old hockey game. Okay, come on, now, let's go. Let's go, it's keep it going. Oh, the good old hockey game. It's the best game you can name. Okay, and one more time and it's all yours. It's the good old hockey game. game. Oh, the good old hockey game. It's the good old hockey Introduce your musicians again, just so I would love to introduce the musicians. Thank you, Moses. Over here, the most talented guy, the, one of the most talented guys I've ever met, plays every instrument, can dance till there's no tomorrow. From Midland, Ontario, Douglas John Cameron. Back there in the drums, he's our only Montrealer, and he happens to be a virtuoso on the drums. You've seen him on all the CDs. You go home and look at all those old albums, and you're going to see that name on there. His name is Al Cross. And back there in the bass, someone who's been playing this kind of music his entire life, and, uh, and we're just grateful to have him. His, if from Oshawa, Ontario. His name is Eric Jackson. <laughs> and of course, uh, Marie Bottrell uh, from London, just an uh, obvious fantastic talent. Thank you, Marie, for guesting tonight. And all of the awards, Russell has a whole room at home full of his awards. One of the most, he, I, I call him the velvet voice of Canadian country music, Russell DeCarl. And the, the young man over here, he's like a son to us. He's from Kincardin, Ontario. Five times, he won so many times they had to retire the award, but five time Canadian national bluegrass fiddle champion, Randy Morrison. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, 
The man that's stomping Tom called the coordinator and the instigator of the Whiskey Jack, Mr. Duncan Fremlin. And let's give the kids one more hand. Thank you.